Hey guys, what's going on? It's Russell. Thought I'd do a quick review of Simpler Trading. So, probably heard of it. They definitely run a lot of ads. They've been around for a long, long time now. And they're run by this guy called John Carter, and this is him here. So he started back in like the 80s, late 80s trading. So he's seen a lot, and he now runs an education system and stock alerts and options alerts, chat rooms, uh, under the company called Simpler Trading. So Simpler Trading, this is it here. I'll leave a link below so you can go and find it. Basically, it's any type of trading you can possibly want to do. So if you look under the membership tab, they have all these different uh, different systems, basically. Now, the cool thing is that most of them are offer like a free trial, not a free trial, but a, like a low cost trial. I think it's $7 for seven days. So it lets you try out the basically the membership so it's good for pretty much everybody you can find like which one that you want to try so for example you could try the Fibonacci one pretty interesting so this is it here talks about Fibonacci apparently that each membership has a chat room and watch lists videos charts and some educational stuff so yeah, here we go, membership with a $7 trial. So it's only for seven days, and then you have to pay the full price, which can be quite expensive. They're not cheap, these services. So let's see what it says. We click on here. Yeah, so $7, but then look at this. So it's $200 a month or $197 a month after that which is pretty high-end. Now, the reason they're able to charge this is because John Carter's reputation is pretty damn awesome. So he's been trading, like I said, for over 20 years. He has written a number one best-selling book on Amazon called Mastering the Trade, this one here. So Mastering the Trade, apparently it was the number one bestseller on Amazon. It's a book that most people read, and it's one of the best books if you're just getting started. Here is an Amazon, Mastering the Trade. You can see it's got like four and a half or 4.7 out of five, 523 ratings. So if you're looking for a book that will set you up, hopefully, for some success, John F. Carter's book, Master in the Trade, might be something to, to check out. So, so he's well known for that book, and he's well known for a lot of big trades. So if you look here, he made $5 million in a single trading day, trading options. And in 2020, he made 15 million trading. And in one trade, uh, $12 million on Tesla. Pretty awesome. So he has a track record. And he's known for... People think that he used, like he invented the TTM squeeze. And he, he didn't. And there's a lot of controversy and people complaining about this if you do a search for it. But he packaged up some of the, the indicator systems that other people had coded, namely TradeStation, and started selling them as his own almost. So people think that he invented the TTM squeeze and he didn't. He just uses it and a bunch of other ones. Uh, I thought he did for a while, but researching this quick review, I found out that most people realize that he didn't invent the squeeze. <laughs> um, and anyway, the squeeze itself, I've tried trading the squeeze, and a lot of people say the same thing, is the squeeze alone doesn't really, isn't really that good, right? Um, there's a lot of fake outs on the TTM squeeze, and you have to add a whole bunch of other indicators and layer it on top, and still, you probably won't be that successful. Really, over the last decade, I've tried so many different indicator systems, including the TTM squeeze, and I've never found it to be to be that reliable for me. I know other people say they have, and some say they haven't. It's kind of 50-50, it seems. So um, one thing that I like about a system that I've been using for a while now, it's the only indicator system or strategy system that I found to work for me consistently, is a dynamic indicator system by a guy called Stephen Brooks. And it's called GPS Trader. And I took a trade on it today. It's kind of a side note. So Netflix. The down arrow and the little dot indicate a short sell indicator. So I took some puts on the option contracts and wrote it down here and stopped out here somewhere uh, for a nice, a nice win. I think 33, 35%. So it was really good. Anyway, this indicator is different because it takes into account a lot of dynamic changing data and doesn't lag. So 
it's not like just a crossover of moving averages or it's a lot better than that. It gives you little lines here that show you where you should set your trilling stops and things. I'll leave a link in the description if you want to go check it out. It's probably my favorite indicator, even though it's more of a, like a full automated strategy than an indicator. Anyway, enough talk about indicators, I think. Let me see what else I've put in this review. So, oh yeah, so a couple of people have done reviews on YouTube already on John Carter. So if we look here, did a quick search. You can see the top one is the real PL. This guy, um, Carl, is super thorough with all his reviews, so you should go and check out his John Carter review. He joined for like a month or something, or maybe longer. He did a four part review series on his YouTube channel, and he actually asked him for a track record for John Carter, and he got one. And he said that it looks legit, everything seems great. This guy made 20 million last year, all the trades seem reliable. Um, so that's a lot coming from Carl because Carl tends to sell options and do spreads and things and he's kind of skeptical when it comes to the buying side of, of options trading so it looks like and you'll have to go and check this out to be sure but it looks like Carl kind of gave his blessing he's one of the most thorough thorough reviewers that I've ever come across uh, to the point that you'll find him really boring if you're not actually like super interested in every tiny little detail <laughs> um, so the other person is David Jaffe he's the next one down here not surprising, David Jaffe calls this, in his opinion, a scam because it's not selling options. So not too surprising, unless you're selling options, Jaffe's going to say it's not legit. So he says it's probably a scam. <laughs> um, you have to make up your own mind. You, at least they do like cheap trials, right, for seven bucks or seven days so you don't have to spend a thousand dollars in one sitting and then find that it's not for you. So quick reminder, they have different classes they have different tools that you can buy memberships to so there's a scanning tool that you have to pay like $97 a month for uh, but it's basically proprietary scanner stuff that I think John Carter uses himself to make some of those huge huge profits that I talked about earlier let's go down here so yeah there's a day trading membership that you get a free trial to the Fibonacci one the scanner one that I was just talking to so yeah it's the actual scanners that John Carter uses so you'd hope that that would be like part of the secret sauce, right, for making 20 million a year. Um, but give it a shot, see what you think. There's no trial for that one, unfortunately, though. Not quite sure why they wouldn't offer that. Um, but they do for pretty much all their other, like, uh, chat rooms and, and, you know, that type of thing. So, so yeah, I haven't tried any of these yet. My plan is to probably try them soon. I've got so much going on, though. I don't, don't really find time to get around to a lot of these things. Uh, I thought I'd bring it to your guys' attention, though, because it does seem like one of the more legit services, even though it's m more on the expensive side. Um, there's a lot to choose from. Like, let's have a look at the simpler edge. What if you could see the data that institutional investors use in real time? Okay. So start your membership. So this is another membership thing without a trial. So this breakthrough is so exciting, short interest can lead to extraordinary trading. In fact, John Carter was able to make 1.41 million in 24 hours because he identified a high short interest. Yeah. So that's kind of interesting, right? The thing they forget to tell you is he used like $10 million to make that 1.4 million or something. So I always take these things with a massive pinch of salt, but um, there's no doubt that John Carter is a legitimate trader though. It's just whether you can replicate his results from the things that he teaches you that could be in question. So anyway, check it out. I'll leave links in the description below and I'll catch up with you guys in the next uh, video review. Cheers.